welcome to Business Standards Industry in Focus. Today we will talk about branded fuels in the country. Low demand and complexity in logistics has made India's largest oil marketing company, Indian Oil Corporation, stop selling its branded diesel extra mile at its retail stations. The ratio of branded fuel to total sales of unbranded fuel for Indian oil has come down to single digits between 5 and 10% in various markets. In 2007, the ratio of the sale of branded fuel amounted to 30% to the overall sale of unbranded fuel for IOCL. Branded diesel scripted a similar downfall. The conversion rate of 20% in 2007 is now as low as 2 to 4 percent. These dismal sales can be attributed to government rulings which led to large price differences. In the 2009 union budget, new duties were introduced on branded fuels, raising the differential between unbranded and branded fuels to 2 rupees 50 paise a litre for petrol and to 4 rupees 95 paise a litre for diesel. Branded fuels took a beating. This weaned truckers who largely patronize both regular and branded diesel away from the latter. In September 2012, another blow was dealt with the government withdrawing subsidy support for branded fuels. The result, even premium and luxury car owners began shunning branded fuels. With the twin nails wedged in, the downward spiral has been difficult to stem and the retail network which offer these branded fuels has shrunk. Oil marketing companies have also been curtailing production and footprint. In the past five years, volumes for Indian oil's branded petrol extra premium has gone down by a little over three times. The difference between branded and unbranded petrol is 8 to 10 rupees a litre, depending on the market. For diesel, it is upwards of 16 rupees. Complex logistics such as factoring in state taxes and duties have served as further deterrence to distributing branded fuels widely in the face of plummeting demand. The network of fuel stations which offer these branded fuels has also diminished. For Indian oil, the number of outlets selling extra premium has come down to 3,421 from 7,071 in the past five years. For Bharat Petroleum, it is down from 3,589 in 2007-8 to 1,626 in 2011-12. Branded petrol outlets for Hindustan Petroleum are down from 2,861 in 2008-9 to 1,100 in 2011-12. The concept of branded fuel came in 2002 when the petroleum sector started investing in marketing. With an influx of new generation cars, public sector oil firms decided to offer variants other than regular fuel. Branded fuels were developed to cater to this need. The ones launched in India were similar to those abroad. The going was good till 2007 when both sales and network expansions peaked. At that time, the maximum difference between regular and branded was 1.5 rupees a litre for petrol and 25 to 75 paise for diesel. That's all in this bulletin. Watch out for more on this space in the afternoon.